Lego feeling like Lego. Lego believing like Lego. I love Lego. Yeah, Lego, Lego, Lego. Guys, I'm only 10 minutes late today. Can I get a, can I get a, oh yeah. I don't have a noise for that. What's the best thing for, um, oh, I forgot to do the I'll be right back thing. Fuck. Do I have to if I, if I add a plugin, if I add a plug-in, do I have to restart OBS? Installing plugins. I don't know. Hello, Madison. Don't mind me. Me drunk. Chris? Chris, Chris, my, my, my dear friend, stop it. Stop that. Stop this. Stop this nonsense, Chris. Stop it. Don't hurt me. Listen, I haven't even tweeted that I'm live yet. Okay, I'm going to. <clears throat> Why is this? Oh my god. I love when my phone... When I make the video and it thinks it's fucking crooked. What's up, Please losers? Please finding Dory tissue paper? Or a tampon? <laughs> Nine months, baby. Currently exhausted from moving dorms. Oh my god! Bitch, why the fuck did you give me money? What's up, losers? I mean gamers. Thank you. Thank you, Chicken Chasm, for the sub. And Lugnudo779 for the bit. Um, first off, gotta- Chris! Chris! I'm gonna say thank you, but don't do that again because I know that you said you're drunk. Um, first off, congrats on congrats on a uh, college. What are you What are you going to college for? I'm so sorry if you. No, Chris. 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 Cause tomorrow you're gonna wake up and you're gonna fucking you're gonna bye Lignudo. I'm you're gonna wake up and you're gonna fucking message me being like oh can you give me back my money and I'm gonna go no I can't I'm really sorry okay sorry I'm trying to tweet that I'm live cancel add thing to tweet so I got new antibiotics I'm on amoxicillin now. Okay, one fucking moment. I have to show you guys some bullshit. Guys, I can't find, I cannot find my medicine. Um, what the fuck? I found it. It fell off my bed. Okay. It fell off my bedside table. Um, I have to tweet that I'm live. Building a massive humongous Lego set. Soup on Twitch. Tweet. Okay. I want to do like a time lapse of this. So... Anyways, majoring in poli sci, that sounds cool. What, okay, so like, what is poli sci? I don't know, it just sounds cool. Also, so, so these pills are like so 
pretty and big. Like, oh my god, wait, is the, is the secondary character in, oh my god, wait. Is the pill character in Osmosis Jones Amoxicillin? Oh, no, it's Drixen all cold relief. He fucking looks like this shit. Because these are a, these are a, um, what the fuck is it called? They're a general antibiotic. They're, like, for everything. So, it's half a minion. Anyways, yeah, so, oh my god. Guys, we're in level three of a hype train. We haven't been on level three of a hype train in 700 years. Can we get to level four? Can we do it? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Uh, so... You know? All thanks to Chris. It's true. Also, yesterday I got these. Um, Martin's Family Fruit Farm Apple Crisps. Okay? Gonna, I'm gonna call everyone out. If you like a little crunchy snack, Apple Crisps are the fucking way to go. Apple crisps are the fucking way to go. Oh my god, these are so good. I love crunch. I love the crunch. I love crunch. Okay, so here's my idea. I'm gonna find the uh, boutique hotel build guide. I'm also gonna look at the Snapchat that Noah sent me. If it will load. Bitch, why the fuck did you give me money? Fnard! Fnard! Thank you. Thank you for the 97 bits. I appreciate it. Sorry, I have to send... Noah, um... Those make you look like a hog farmer. Like, I used to watch a show where they would farm hogs and make sausage out of them. That, yeah. Yeah. Anyways. You don't have to know the context behind that. Okay. All the bits I had left. Fnord. Fnord is giving me his last, all of the last bits he has. All of his last bits. I have to like, I have to like fart really bad and I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why. Oh no, I do know why. Okay, by the way, if you're on antibiotics and you fucking fart, Sorry, I was just apologizing for accidentally being passive aggressive. Don't worry about it. Okay. I was gonna do something. Oh, I was gonna get. Okay, here's what I'm doing. Um. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna get the build guide for this Lego set. I took the ADHD meds, they just haven't kicked in. Lego, let's go. Absolutely. fucking lutely Okay, so, also, I'm on the same mind brain track. I was, okay. I'm posting. Okay, cool. I'm posting the link soup on Twitch. You fucker. Done. Post to my story. Okay. So... You guys are mean. You guys are bullying me. Uh, no, I was grabbing this, which is my tripod, because this is such a big Lego set, I kind of want to get, like, a cool shot, like, time lapse of it, so I'm gonna do that. But to do that, I have to... 
crank this bad boy out. Never mind, I'm not gonna sleep yet. Hell yes, Bard. What's it up? So this is uh, that set. It is the Lego set 10, 2, 9, 7. I thought that was how many pieces are in it, and I was like, no, there's no way. And I was correct, there is no way. Um, but it's the Lego Boutique Hotel. It's part of their modular building set, which is really cool. I love the modular building sets because they look really cool when you display them. Um, does it fit on the desk? The entire thing might not, but we're, we're gonna find out. And I was gonna get a collapsible table, but the collapsible table I have is currently in my closet storage area. And I was like, I don't want to get that out. <laughs> you know, I was like, it, it's in my storage area, but it's being used. It has stuff on it. It has like my resin printer on it in there. And I was like, uh, uh, and then I didn't get it out because I didn't want to. It'll probably collapse during the build. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I prob well, probably because of me, but yeah. Okay. So let's put this like right here. So this is, I like this tripod because it's falling over because I did not stably do this. Cool. Now let's go back to this. What the fuck? I thought I just screwed you. Oh, I did it. Do it the wrong way. God damn. <clears throat> okay. We're good. So I like this tripod because this attachment piece for it um, can go in this way or this way. So it can actually be like a little boom uh, arm type situation. Which I think is cool. Okay, why can't I rotate this? Okay, that's weird. Oh, but you have to unscrew this thing, which you can also add a counterweight to. What kind of tripod? Uh, I gotta be honest, I don't know the name. Oh, it's a Yotalon. Y-O-T-I-L-O-N. How much are these? One minute. Yotalon tripod. This is $129? Oh, that's like a similar one. Oh, but there's a $7 coupon. Okay, so this is like one of those tripods where it was just at a Best Buy, I think. Or, no, okay. So when I was younger, I wanted to be a YouTuber. I would like to go over this story. I wanted to be a YouTuber so bad. So one time when I moved to Arizona, my mom and I went to Costco, knowing nothing about cameras, and we got a camcorder. And I did, an, I did an ALS ice bucket challenge with that thing. But I had a camcorder and I got a tripod. This is not that tripod. But, like, I don't know. It just reminded me of that, which was kind of cute. That, as a child, I was like, I want to be a YouTuber, mommy. I did not sound like that. So, what generation does Forrest Gump belong to? Uh, he's his own thing. He's, like, his own thing. Also, I kind of hate the moral of that story. It's, like... You're just, he has a disability, but then, like, he stops being disabled with that disability and then achieves things. But he's also still disabled. I don't fucking know. Listen, I personally, uh, I don't know. I personally do not know. This is the, this is the thing that I have to use to hold this iPhone because it's so big. Also, can I just say, back when I was young, webcams were 320p 15 FPS. The first ever webcam I use, I think, is over here. So, uh, no, it isn't. It's somewhere else. But when I first started, this is why it pisses me off when, <clears throat> when people are like, you wouldn't have, people used to attack me frequently and say like you wouldn't have live streamed if it weren't for if it weren't for LTT you wouldn't have you wouldn't have even continued to live stream blah 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 <clears throat> and it makes it makes me upset because it's like first off I was live streaming before that just putting that out there I had live streamed for a long time before that I stopped because I couldn't anymore so like people 
people go, you wouldn't have live streamed, blah, blah, blah. It's like, yeah, because my fucking computer couldn't handle it. Duh. <clears throat> I have to blow my nose so fucking bad. Do I own tissues? good as we're getting because I don't own a tissue box. <coughs> Anyways. They were like, you wouldn't have blah, 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 blah. And they all had a stroke. Anyways. But like, it annoys me so much. Because so what if someone started streaming because they had some opportunity? That's like telling a child actor, you wouldn't be famous if you weren't on that one show. It's like, Fucking duh, that's how you get recognition, by being on things. Chris! <coughs> Stop it! But also, thank you. Hello, the eater. I'm a sexy little Minecraft Makes chicken. Makes you normally to tell. It's, yeah, that's true. He my friend. Oh, well, hi, person's friend. Are you only playing Elite Dangerous, or do you want, do you do other flight sims? Um... I apologize for how much I'm going to have to mute this stream. I think since I'm now back on antibiotics, they're breaking up the mucus and, like, shit that's stuck in my nose. So it's coming out. Also, look at this Henry the Hype Shark sticker that Noah printed for me. Amazing. Anyways, uh, it just it just made me upset because it's, like, it makes me upset when people... Noah is the goat. When people, like... Also, also, that's just, like, it, it's just discrediting someone. Because, like, so what if a famous person continued to be famous because they got lucky? It's like, okay, guess what? If an actor who's really good at acting gets super lucky and gets randomly spotted, it's like, okay, cool. Their skill is still lies within acting, which is the reason that they're now successful. It isn't like, oh, magically because of that thing, I, I gained a personality. It's like, no. I had a personality, it just so happened now people saw it and went, oh, I kind of like that. So, I don't know. It's just annoying to me. Do you think you are lucky? I'm gonna go over a few of the events that happened that have happened in my life, okay? <clears throat> Matthew, you won't believe what British are gonna call Columbia. British Columbia. Palm from Circuit. Okay. Here here's why I think I have a very odd balance of luck. <clears throat> so it'll be like So like Uh, you know, one of my friends has said, like, I have really weird luck, because it'll be, like, one day something horrible happens, and the next day I win the lottery. But, like, this is, this is the circumstances of me even being, like, in, in Vancouver. So, one, I, I, like, ha I'm unlucky, and for some reason I'm in Calgary because something bad happened. Okay, cool. Two, I'm like, oh, rig reboot, I'm gonna enter that. Three, I win this computer. Four, uh... This, my stream goes up and down and whatever. I get hate mail. Whatever. Five. I get this job. Six. My fucking brother dies. Seven. I move across the country. Eight. I get sexually assaulted. Nine. Uh, job turns out to not be that great for my mental health. Not be really great circumstance. So I quit. Ten. I get this other really cool job. Like, how the- like, the ups and downs. It's like, woo 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 woo! Eleven. Someone gives me this Lego set. And by someone I mean Van Wool. Pretty lucky. That's life. Da da. Wait, what are the lyrics? <laughs> I don't even know the lyrics to a famous song. Oh, that's life. Oh, wait, wait. wait. Um, in there somewhere is meeting Noah. Uh, and then the the high was meeting Noah. The low was me going. I don't want to date you long distance. That's too hard. The high was me going. Actually, I do. Do 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 do. 
Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> you know, I feel like I feel like it's very much this sound effect. Would you consider your luck to be net good luck? Oh, absolutely. But like, I think that's mostly because if I were to choose within, and that was within 10 minutes. No, this is literally, it, so it's like, I get this job, okay? And with, I have to move within two weeks. Within two weeks, I have to pack up everything that exists in my, in my like, in my, everything that's mine, I have to pack up within like a week and ship to Vancouver from the United States, okay? I have to find a place to live. I have to get a plane ticket. I have to get a really fancy COVID test. I have to do all this stuff because I started the job in a month, which meant that I had to get there within two weeks because the two week quarantine period was still a thing at that time. So it was like within two weeks, I had to have a place to live. You made the video that got you the PC, so that wasn't luck, that was talent. See, that's also what, like, what I think. It's like, yes, it was lucky that whoever was watching these videos thought that it was funny, but it wasn't luck that I made it. It's like, I spent the time making that. I sat on my floor with my fucking iPhone editing that iMovie on a Mac that was, like, breaking. So, anyways, so, so I had to pack up all my shit within this two-week period. And then, like, the, the day, <clears throat> the day, so, like, this is, this is the trauma. This is the trauma of it. And... I think my mom would be annoyed if I was like, oh, this is what happened. But like the general gist of it is I was packing my shit into, uh, yeah, I was packing my shit into like the, not my shit, my lovely stuff into the back of a van and like I saw a cop car pull up and I was, there's a cop with their lights on. No, no siren. So I'm like, oh, okay. It was 3 a.m. So I was like, maybe this is a noise complaint whatever. They pull up and I'm like, what is it? Basically it ended up being, oh, your, your brother's passed away. And I'm like, are you, what? Excuse me? I'm moving in a day. How am I supposed to leave my parents? Like what, what do you mean? So that's where my luck gets real quirky. So good evening, young lady. Good evening, chopper. Can't believe we have to sadly have this conversation on the soup show. I want a really cool like little banner that says soup show. I just clicked something and I don't know what it did. How do I, how do I close the, uh, how do I, uh, guys, how do I close the, the big view? Is it F, it's F11. Found it. Yeah, so I'm not, I'm not going to go into the details. Fish nest, right? But it's like, life is very up and down. My fucking luck is shit lucking fuck. What? I just had a stroke reading that. <laughs> but yeah, so. But now I have a job that I actually really like. And things seem to be like on the up and up, you know? Someone just set your luck to the repeating digits of pi just to fuck with you. Hell yeah. It's be looking like I said. I've had the Imperial Star Destroyer sitting unbuilt for eight months. That's okay. So like any of the really expensive like thousand dollar Lego sets, I just can't imagine owning because I would build it and then be like, what do I do? What do I do now? What do I do now? Okay, I'm gonna set this camera up and try and see if I can get like a nice view. Anyways, that all came up because someone asked about my luck. And it reminded me that this is my brother's phone. And okay, I wish that, I wish that there was something I could have done to like get the stuff off of this phone, but like there, there, Apple now has this thing where you can set up on your phone if you die and you want your family to be able to get into your phone and they don't know your password, like, they can get into it by contacting Apple. But that wasn't a thing at the time. So, pretty much, like, I had to wipe this phone and I feel horrible, but, like, there is nothing we could have done. Because if you want to get into an Apple phone, uh, you need some sort of court order that gives you a legitimate reason to get into a deceased person's phone and like being like I just want to know what's on it isn't one of those things because that breaks that person's rights so Any Lego set over a certain amount feels like it needs to come with a glass display cabinet I've seen people put like the star just no the imper the ship The ship and like a table But also I feel like Display covers are really cool. Star Destroyer ship. Death Star! Fuck, yeah. Just Star Destroyer. Even then, Apple won't let you sometimes. Yeah, because, like... 
they they don't want it to become the precedent that if you have an Apple phone and you die, anyone can get into it. So they can't really do that, which just it just sucks because it's like obviously there's no malicious intent most of the time with someone being like I just want to like see what was on their phone because you know they're gone. But like it wasn't a desk, sorry. It was a coffee table. It was like a clear glass coffee table that they had put the thing in so it was like covered but it was really cool looking this water tastes weird I'm going on Costco.ca. How much is a blood pressure checker? Blood pressure monitor. I don't want a pressure washer. Oh my god. I'm just concerned about my blood pressure. Because, like, every time I go to the doctor, they're like, you're really great. But 40 to 50, I'm guessing. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Pardon me. They're like, oh, you're, you're really great. I could get Dr. Ho's blood pressure monitor. These all have horrible reviews. Ah, oh, shit. But Maybe I'm... that's why my computer smells like roasted ass. Thank you, Tripic, for the sub. So, mine was up. Now it's down. Good good job, Fishnet, I think. I, or I don't know if you're making a joke. Honestly, everything that has happened, it feels like you just need a massive hug and to punch whoever has access to your Sims luck profile. Honestly, hugs are great. I definitely love hugs. Um... I learned, <laughs> I learned not to say that to grown men, uh, re re not recently, but you know, I learned never to say that to a man, um, who you're just friends with because they will go, oh, but why won't you hug me? You said you love hugs. Why won't you give me a hug? And then you just have to be like, because you've now over, you've now stepped, you've now crossed a boundary I have where instead of it being a... I would enjoy a hug. Would you like to give me a hug? It's a you asking me for one, which is weird. So stop. Drop and fucking leave. Thank you. Anyways. <laughs> Depends on who gives you the hug. Oh my god. Yeah, overdraft for the hug bank. Absolutely. That's a that that is a big problem I had <laughs> when I moved. Uh overdraft the hug bank. I'm like I'm like a touchy feely person, but I also am pretty sure I have autism, so like it has to be touchy feely on my terms. Otherwise, it's like I cannot deal with it. Like when Noah came to visit me the first time, I like had I hadn't lived with anyone for about a like eight months at that point. So it was like suddenly there was someone in my apartment, and they were just like there, and like not even touchy feely, but just like being in my space. I was like, I like this. Ah. Ah, P.S. is self-care time. It's always self-care time, Muffin. Always. Every day. Okay, I was gonna look up- I have a coupon for Costco.ca that's $20 off of a $100 purchase, so like, do they have Lego on here? Oh. My. God. Bitch, why the fuck did you give me money? They have Lego on here. Thank you. They have Lego on here, which means that I can get $20 off of a Lego set. Might I say that I have not once touched Jamosi as far as I know while he was here. Not related, but realized. Oh, well, I mean, like, you guys didn't high five or hug. Chat, that also means you said self-care. Hydrate and stretch. Absolutely. Some shops sell Lego that Lego stores don't because they have exclusive distribution. That is cool. They also have Lego architecture sets, which are cool, but definitely feel like they're... <gasps> oh my god, Costco has the Lego Creator Expert Assembly a Square 1025 with bonus Lego Star Wars The Child. Wait, bonus Lego Star Wars The Child? Ooh, I kind of want this, but it's like $400. Mm, I have to sit here and think about it. Let me do the budgeting in my brain. I feel like the architecture sets are really simple, but like absolutely fucking overpriced for the amount of pieces you get. So I don't really want them, but the architecture sets are good as well because they all fit together. Yeah, no, the, the architecture sets, the like, those ones look cool. Like, aren't they all on like a road? Sorry, I have to
Noah, Noah's at the beach right now, like, with his mom, because they're visiting Florida. His parents are, not, not him. And he just fucking sent me a Snapchat of sandpipers, of baby sandpipers. Because we want you to be the happiest version of you, and having one less burn on your body will help with that. Absolutely. Why would I want self-care? Oh my god, wait. Muffin? I have some- One second, muffin. This made me think of you, and it was on sale for $8, and so naturally I bought it because it was on sale for $8. <laughs> it just... <laughs> it says, Hydrate, Exercise, Sleep, Self-Care Club. Small shirt. This is, yeah, I fit this shirt so well. Anyways... I got this shirt. Code for bashing the bitch. Is it comfy? Absolutely. I really should rename my Twitch channel self Hell yeah. Hello. What are you- what, what are you live at three in the morning? I don't know. Time zones? I love this shirt. I'm, it's like a pajama shirt, but I'm gonna wear it over this for a while. I also- one second. My ADHD meds make me sweat like a lot. And here's the thing. Totally fine. Usually doesn't smell or anything, but I just don't like my armpits feeling wet. I want that shirt, but it's going to be like a fucking full blanket on me. Listen, it's a full- Are you saying that you think this shirt fits me well? It's a pajama shirt. I got it at Forever h and I got it at H&M, but it might not be there anywhere because it was on clearance, so. Just what- Oh, those stray thoughts. I'm sorry. I just had to vomit in my mouth a little bit. I think I'm smaller than you. Your name is Small Muffin, so- no, I do, if I sweat, I do smell, but, like, okay, here's the thing. I learned that there is, like, workout sweat, which is usually, like, salt, like, normal. It's, like, liquid. But there is anxiety sweat, which is what I usually get, which has a different kind of bacteria in it, which interacts with the bacteria on your skin, which is what causes body odor. Science. My ADHD meds make me real thirsty, and no matter how much I drink, I'm still thirsty. Yeah, I think that that is a, that is a side effect. Mine gives me, give me, like, a really dry mouth, which is annoying, but fine. And I got a lower cell content because bacteria hate salts. Oh, okay, that makes sense, too. Okay, so, <clears throat> boutique building instructions. Can I download, oh, I can download a PDF? That's sick. Oh, can I not download a PDF? Lego Boutique Oh my god, I can't spell. Lego Boutique Build Instructions. Desktop. Okay. I'm going to do this quirky thing called open that file if I can find it. Where did it go? I don't know. Oh, there it is. Crack that bitch open. Okay, cool. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, now we have- I don't give a fuck! Thank you, McFart head. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. Um, I wanna try this quirky little thing. Called- This is probably not gonna be that useful, actually, now that I think about it, but it might be funny, so I'm gonna keep doing it. That's the model of my life. Okay, so we got a green screen. Don't look at how sad my butt looks in these pants. Thank you very much. So on the green, I want to... I want to... Add a... Window capture? Okay. Can I put that under here, please? Bam. And then, if I do this, and I turn. <laughs> that on, and I make it big. C 
cool. Nailed it. So, anyways, these are the building instructions for the Lego thing we're making. Hell yeah, a green screen table. I love how it's chroma keyed your paint on left. Oh, that is kind of funny. Okay, wait, we could have a green screen table maybe. back okay I've got this piece of green isn't that cool okay now if we go to my uh, desk down cam oh my god it's just green screen now <laughs> it's green screen now can I okay wait can I copy this window capture and then bring it with me to the desk down cam well, that's not where I fucking wanted that to go. Okay, can I make it smaller? Okay, wait, if I change this, is it gonna change it in here? It didn't, we're good, okay. So, let's make this like really small and put it up here. Don't make fun of me, but I'm watching Spider-Man from 2002. Why would I make fun of you for that? I love Spider-Man. I had to watch that for that one movie podcast that I was on and then everyone fucking gave me hate mail for, so, yeah. Mock Lego instructions where it shows the pieces and go step one, complete the model. I fucking love those things. Okay, so here's this little green thing. Uh, so I have to add a filter? Chroma key? Oh my god, look at that shit. Okay, wait. It's pretty, guys, can we talk about how pretty, like, how good this is? Sorry, I might have moved my mic away from my thing. Look at this shit. Okay, wait, so, like, I need a little bit of tape. Do I have green tape? I fucking better. Oh, my God! Guys, we, you abs of fucking ass white. Oh, my food grade allergy-free textured finger gloves fell. Fuck! Oh my god, wait, I could have done like this. This is a, in case you can't tell, this is like a Lego board. Wow, I tried to show you, but I forgot. I also have a green screen over here. Wow, go me. Anyways, continuing on, I have green tape. So now what I can do is I can Give this a little, a little tape and we can have it so that it stays secure. Oh, this is the best. Oh, this is fucking legendary. Oh, I'm so smart. I like Andrew Garfield too. Oh, I love, listen, I loved Andrew Garfield. 
Andrew Garfield was the first Spider-Man that, like, I watched, and I remember, okay, so my brother wasn't home, and for some reason, my brother had, at this point in time, like, moved into the basement. I don't know why, okay? He just lived in the basement, kind of. <clears throat> and we didn't even have, like, a basement that was, like, with a door or anything. It was literally just, like, the stairs were open and went down to the basement, and my brother was like, I'm gonna live there. Everyone was like, oh, fuck, okay, I guess. Because it kind of just moved. <laughs> so... Like, he didn't ask permission. No, wait, I'm pretty sure he did. And both my parents said, no, you're not allowed to live in the basement. And he went, okay, and moved his mattress down there. And then no one did anything because it was like, is this a problem? Whatever. So anyways, he was like gone with his friends one night. And I was like, oh my God. And I was amazed by the fact that you could use the Xbox to get online. <clears throat> and I was amazed by like Netflix or something. And they had The Amazing Spider-Man, and I went, I haven't seen this movie, and I really like Marvel. Huh. So I watched it, and I was like, oh my god. And it turned out it was, like, The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Anyways. That was my first intro to Spider-Man. I will say, I do think that it goes Tom Holland, Andrew Garfield. Uh, I forgot his name. I feel like an asshole. Whatever. Um... I do feel like that is the ranking of Spider-Mans just because Tom Holland looks the youngest and feels more awkward. Tobey Maguire. My bad. Anyways, so this is our little Lego thing. Should I try and make this like- Oh my god, it's so funny. The camera's going out of focus on everything, but because of this. The camera's like out of focus, but the green screen stays in focus because it's fucking green screened in. Oh, by the way, I have a watch recommendation for everyone. Watch, if you have Disney Plus, watch Industrial Light Magic. It's such a, it is such a cool like docu-series about Star Wars. I'm tempted to get a picture of home, put it on the desk using the green screen. Of a hole. Oh my god, what if I just- what if I just did this? What if I just did this? One second. Oh guys, look, I- I already built it. I already built it. Just kidding. That's not funny because it didn't- it wasn't transparent which is sad, but it's fine. I already built it. <laughs> I remember seeing the first Toby Spider-Man movie in theaters and what a big deal that was in my small hometown. That's cool. I'm gonna put some dirt in your eyes. Why would you say that to me? Why would you say that? If you know how I feel, why would you say that? My BD1 is supposed to get here on Monday. So I'm excited about that. I'm a Marvel fanboy. I absolutely love Marvel. I'm less into it now. Like I used to go, I used to like, see every movie in theaters i was doing all that shit but like i don't really i now that they've killed off iron man spoiler alert i'm just i'm kind of over it not over it like i hate it but over it like eh. Eh. Okay, guys, can you hear my, um, can you hear the AC unit and is it annoying? Cause like, if yes, sorry, look at my little Lego set, look at my little Lego set. Okay. Wait, which Star Wars documentary did you recommend? Um, it's called Industrial Light Magic or ILM, which is the sort of like studio that George Lucas ended up creating industrial light and magic yeah it sort of started creating because like star wars um star wars was very much the first of its kind in like almost all of its special effects stuff like they wanted to do things that hadn't been done before so they had to like they had to like make 
they had to like make whole camera rigging systems, figure out all of these like ways to do these matte painting things, and it's just really cool. It's just really cool. I like that this Lego box, this is such a big set that they, they have a thing on the box so you can like lock it. Like it's a fucking box of corn dogs and you might open it and not eat all of them. Oh my god. What have I gotten myself into? Oh my god. Oh my god. the fuck? I didn't realize this had so many pieces. I should have, but like I didn't. I like, okay, well, let's maybe, let's put these back in the box a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna have to reorder, restructure. We have to restructure this. I started getting into embroidery because I can never have too many hobbies. Look at my little embroidery I'm doing. It's a gonk droid. It's on my it's on my little my little jacket. Thanks. Okay. Just start the beginning. I mean, yeah, okay, listen, like every other thing in life, this is gonna be a one step at a time. There's so much fucking Lego on my floor. Um So, was no one going to tell me that when a uh, Lego set has 3,000 pieces, that means... It has 3,000 fucking pieces?! Anyways, I'm streaming putting this together right now. I might be for the next seven years. Who knows? Sorry, I had to make a TikTok. We have all the modular buildings. We have them in these IKEA display cases in our Lego room. They're amazing. I want them like all here or there like i want i want all of them but some of them are no longer in existence so i'm looking at like the mock ones that people have made and i might do those so was no one even tell me that when uh lego set has 3,000 pieces that means it has 3,000 hashtag live now hashtag lego hashtag streaming hashtag lego build I am scared. Post. Save. Post. Sorry, I'm just a social media influencer. Anyways, let's... Do you still do stream announcements where you throw things at the camera? Absolutely. Um, I feel like one of those... I feel like a skateboarder. Hey, guys. Do you guys want to go to the skate park later? Oh, my God. This is kind of cute, actually. Oh, snatched. I'm a snatched boarder. Anyways, okay. Let's... This looks like the thing my fucking diploma came in. look like a skateboard or tbh that's really nice i'm sorry i didn't realize i was getting a fucking textbook with my lego order purchase fuck dude okay i'm gonna have to clean some shit off my desk we're gonna start soon i promise here you guys can look at my deodorant while you wait
I have this little lamp thing that I think needs new batteries because it kind of sucks. But it's cool, but it kind of sucks. Whoa! Okay. I have these little bins for, like, yeah, for doing stuff. Oh, someone asked me a long time ago what my, um, if you're still here, what my interface was. I have a audio complete spelt with a K1. Uh, it was really basic. It was like 99 USD when I bought it, which is why I got it. Cause I finally got one, uh, an AT2020 and I was like, oh, I can't just plug this in using USB. It's an XLR mic. So I just got like the cheapest XLR thing available. So yeah, that's that. I'm going to dump all the shit in here. cool that is. Ah. <laughs> okay. Mike? Oh no. Did I break it? Hello? Hello? Oh god. Oh god. Huh? No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Oh god. That scared me. I thought I broke my mic. Okay. So I guess we go to step one of this, which is look at these people. Wow. Then we have, so I guess we need one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And we need, oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, let's find one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Um. And the little thing. Okay. We got one. Um, two, three, four, five. Is this six? I don't understand. Cause this is, these are both seven. Are they both? Oh, wait, okay, we don't need seven? Okay, we don't need seven. Oh, God. Uh. <laughs> Why have you got headphones on? What are you listening to? Everything. Dump them all in a big tub. Fnord, apps, I'm not doing that. That sounds like a fucking horrible idea. I'm so sorry, but no. Um. Cause this is six, but like, this is six, but like, this is nine, but that's nine. Like, there's, there's two nines. I'm so confused. Well, I guess we're just gonna figure it out. Madison's microphone is a Nintendo DS plugged into a proprietary Nintendo amp. Are you a splitter or a bucket builder? I am a bin bitch that's my new lego term i just came up with okay this is one no that's five this is one okay fuck do i have like a little box this is the bin <clears throat> okay let's figure out how to set this up so that i can 
get a nice little time lapse of this happening. Time lapse. Okay, cool. Oh, fuck me. Okay, cool. Sorry guys, I'm rotating. I'm straight rotating. Okay, cool. We got the time lapse going. <sighs> okay. Uh, so this is one. Would this help? That's not even plugged in. Damn. Ow. Lego everywhere. Ugh, my back. Okay, wait. Does this help us? Do you guys, do you guys like this? Does this help? Absolutely not. Never mind. Your shirt looks like you got in trouble at school and had to put another shirt over it. I did. I got banned from a uh, b-ball court. Ah! Our little carrot thing! Okay. Bag number one! Fuck you! Be gone, ho! Okay, and then we got our little pieces like this and this okay so it says step one is this is the same both sides step one is but okay step one is put one of these here and then these are I hope wait are these right one two three four five six one two three four five okay we're gonna put some of these six things down okay but it okay it ends with one of these on the corner so we're gonna put some of these down first oh my god oh my god okay we got that. We did step one. Are we done? No. Oh, God. Okay. So now we're on to step two, which is clusterfuck. Okay? This is a... So we have to go one, two... We have to go three over and put this down in the middle and then do three, four, five of these over three, four... Five of these over into one grate, into one sewer grate looking thing, okay? And then we have to go, where are these bricks? And then we have to go two up, like this, I'm gonna take this off my wrist, two up into one of these little dudes, and then uh, whatever the fuck that is, what is that? Where is that piece? Uh, is this it? Into one of these little fucky-wucky bricks. Is this in focus? It better be. Anyways, this goes here, like that. Is it in focus? Someone needs to tell me. Nah, only when school had uniforms. I had uniforms from okay what are these these are wait what okay these are one two three four five six okay so these are sixers so they're these ones and i need three of them so these are supposed to go like this and build a little a little perimeter and then on the edge part i have to do one of these here and then one of them like this I'm doing this like it's a puzzle where I'm doing the thing, the outside. Um, my uniform, one minute, can I just Google it?
Uh, the formal uniform at my school conser- consisted of a CGS blazer, kilt or pants, a white Oxford shirt tucked in, a necktie, black knee socks or tights, and dress shoes. Please note that a vest or sweater is not part of the formal uniform. Our formal uniform is required to be worn on the following days. The first day of school, school photos, special occasions for guest visitors, and occasions where the girls are representing our school on field trips unless otherwise specified by the teacher. Hair should also be neat at all times. While hijabs must be plain in color and compl- complement the uniform, any jewelry or body piercing should be respectful of the school environment. Other consideration, students are to wear modest shorts under their kilts. Any garments to be worn under blouses or shirts must be white or off-white. Dress shoes must be black and polished or present and patent with a low heel. The winter uniform consists of a combination of blazers, cardigans, or vest, the Oxford shirt, shirt tucked in in white, kilt, pleated skirt, black uniform pants, or black tights with black tights or knee socks. Chat under the chat. Uh, yeah, definitely could do that. Nope, wrong button. There we go. Yeah, the longer chat messages are doing shit. One minute, let me see if I can fix that. Thank you so much. You're welcome, Trinor. What if I do that? When the boys all start wearing kilts transitional style. I mean, okay, this was- CGS stands for Calgary Girls School, to be very specific, so that's why this is like, wear a fucking kilt. Um, the summer uniform is summer dress with white knee socks, blazer cardigan or vest, an Oxford shirt tucked in with tie, a polo shirt or poplin blouse, kilt, black uniform pants, pleated skirt or black skirt with black tights or knee socks. Note, the summer uniform can be worn beginning after spring break into the fall until Thanksgiving weekend. The athletic uniform is a gym shirt, dry fit shorts, a zip-up hoodie, jogging pants, white socks, and appropriate athletic shoes. No, athletic uniform is required for every gym class. Students may also wear full zip-up hoodie and polar fleece jackets as outerwear to and from school. However, these are not worn in school as part of the uniform. I would just like to bring up these, these things. So the poplin blouse was a softer fabric. The fucking polo shirt was this thick, scratchy ass cotton material that you had to wear. And so I was in choir. I know. God bless me. I was in choir. So we had to wear this to choir every, every fucking day. Okay. Every second day or whatever. Uh, the choir room was in what was called a portable, which meant it was like a fucking, it was a porta potty. It was, it was a building that they had moved in on a big, like fucking truck put it down, put some wood under it, and it was attached to the building. It was not, like, a build up of the thing. Um, so it didn't have AC. So in the summertime, I know, Calgary, you'd think it's cold. It's not. It's fucking hot. In the summertime, you were sweating in that goddamn portable with your fucking, you were standing there. You weren't allowed to sit in choir. This is what we had to do. Uh, when every heart joins every heart and to get that's when we'll be free and we would just have to stand there like like this like this for hours going many hour any day the time soon will come when men will live in dignity that's when we'll be free when every heart joins every heart and it was just like hours of their like dripping sweat dying and here's the thing i didn't know this at the time but i have sensory issues so like that shirt if you did this it hurt like it would scratch your back i remember days where i would come home and i would wear the seams were i would have giant red lines where the seams of the shirt had rubbed my skin raw Tell me how that's good for us, like, a child. At least a Catholic upbringing has led you to leading a pious lifestyle. It wasn't a Catholic school. This was a, this was a, this was a fucking charter school where we were called the lab rats because they would test different teaching styles on us, which also led to us uh, when you're not getting fucking grades. We got words. So if you were, like, if you were had, like, an A, 
You, okay, so I grew up having grades that were like, if you had an E on your report card, that meant excellent, excelling, amazing. Then I went to fucking CGS, and one year they had us where we didn't get fucking grades. So, like, imagine you're going to college, and you're, like, trying to get in, and your fucking transcript from school, from, like, grade 10 or whatever, says, oh, you were expanding. That was the best grade you could get. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, I was expanding. Sorry. I was, exp I was expanding my knowledge. That sounds like you suck. That sounds like you're an idiot and don't know what you're doing. Also, this fucking school was a joke because, like, we, I turned in bullshit. Aside. I just, I would test how fucking far I could, how far I could go, you know? I'd be like, we had, we had, <laughs> we had a project that was about lights and lenses and, like, art and stuff. And so, you were supposed to, like, use lenses and, like, refract light and then, like, explain what your thing meant. So, what I, and you were supposed to, um, you were supposed to, like, fold shapes out of, like, paper. So, like, you know rectangles and stuff and it was supposed to be like math and science combined so what i did was i i crumpled up all of the paper put it in a box and like shone a flashlight through it and i fucking wrote my essay and my essay was the shit my essay was like my project represents the beauty standards of today's society and how no one can truly be beautiful and we're all blah 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 i got an a on that assignment that assignment was something that we worked on for like two months in those two months, I painted a cardboard box to look like a ladybug, and I put paper in it. Crumpled up paper. Tossed it in. Flashlight. A. It's not, it's not impressive. That's not a win. That's bad. Because then when I went to a real fucking school, they were like, um, why don't you know how to do basic fucking math? They were like, why, why don't you know how to do, like, these math things that you should have learned in grade 7? And it's like, oh, well, because, see, in my class, we didn't learn that. They handed us worksheets, and if we didn't turn them in, they kind of went, oh, damn. Sucks. But it's okay, because I, I graduated. 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 What can I say? What can I say? I graduated. No one can say I didn't graduate, because I did. I did graduate. I'll have you know. But here's the thing. This wasn't like, this wasn't like a school where they treated teachers horribly. This was like a good school. Like, this is a school people, you had to, I had to fucking interview to get into this school. I switched schools. Okay, let's fucking, one second. I switched schools, um, okay, grade one and two, okay, preschool, kindergarten, one school. Grade one and two, a different school. Grade three, different school grade four a different school grade five and six a different school grade seven and eight a different school grade eight no grade seven a different school great sorry let me redo this kindergarten preschool grade one and two grade three grade four grade five grade six grade seven grade eight grade nine 10th 11th 12th grade i went to eight schools within the 12 like years of normal of just like school i went to eight schools like what Oh, okay, yeah, sorry. Let's get back to the Lego build. Um, so, we're gonna need some of these. We're gonna need some of these pieces. This goes there. That goes there. Click. Pardon me. I don't know how tall this is gonna be, so I kind of hope it fits in one of those shelves, but it honestly might not, which would be kind of sad, but, like, I'll just, I'll put it somewhere else, and I'll still look at it and go, wow, that thing's fucking sick. Sing us more choir songs. Um, no. I don't want to. Sorry. I don't remember any more of the choir song. That's not true. I probably do, but, like, I was not good at choir, so, yeah. I thought I was, but I was not. There were bitches in choir who thought they were, like, hot shit, and it was like, mm, no, you actually aren't. You're actually really bad at this, and you should not be in choir, but whatever. I was downstairs when this thing was going on. I did wonder what was going on. <laughs> on a more cheerful note, not feeling... Feelings on the Dread film with Carl Urban. Plague Lord. I have a signed poster from Carl Urban that is of, like, him playing Judge Dread. So that's my feelings on it. If it isn't clear, I liked it. I've only seen it once, though. But I should watch it again. I saw it once when I definitely, like, was probably too young to be seeing it. I remember having a horrible migraine and eating a... 
chicken wrap from McDonald's. So, it was a great day. What can I say? Like, it was amazing. I was amazed. I loved it. It was a wonderful time eating that chicken wrap, watching people's heads get fucking exploded. What more can you ask for, really? Is this supposed to be dark gray? Yeah. What more can you ask for, really? It's a film that desperately needs a sequel. I mean, like, I don't know. I feel like its story was kind of self-contained and cool. I also haven't seen it in a long time, so it could definitely need a sequel. Okay, here's a thing that, like, probably doesn't need a sequel because I don't think anyone li liked this movie, but Alita Battle Angel. If, okay, I wish they hadn't have given her the fucking anime eyes in that movie, but I genuinely thought that it was a really cool movie. Like, I liked it. And it really sucks that, um... It kind of was stupid as hell. Kind of was dumb. They kind of they kind of fucked it up a bit. But like, I genuinely really liked it. So I am a bit butthurt that it turned out so poorly. I really wanted to do an Alita Battle Angel, like the the porcelain costume. I wanted to do a cosplay of it so bad. But I'm like looking at it and I'm just going, I don't think that I could do that. Like, I really want to. Also, so these are the little connectors that let you, like, connect the buildings on this side. So this is how it's modular. Um, but, like, I just think that that costume is so pretty and cool and intricate. But I don't think anyone liked the movie enough to go out and, like, 3D model any of those parts. So I would have to figure out how to 3D model them so I could probably resin print them and cast them. Or I would have to sculpt them all. And I'm going to be honest, I don't think that I have the patience or dedication or the money to actively just do that for, like, years. So, you know? But I just thought it was really cool. Mostly because I like the setting. Okay, so now we're moving on to step four. Oh, goodness. Okay, step four, we start with a little this thing in the corner, like this, right? Like that cool and then we have a six six two okay we have a six and a six and a two one goes like this and then we have this goes up and then we have this goes this way then we have a four and this and another four Okay, cool. Sick. Now we have to build- Oh my god, we're adding wood floors! We're adding wood floors! This is not a drill, people. We're adding wood floors! Oh my god, this is so cute. They're like little wood plank floors. Oh my goodness. I love that shit. I love that shit. That shit is so cool. I feel bad because I'm probably never gonna take this Lego set apart to like show the individual kind of like things. So it feels, one, two, three, four. So it feels kind of silly to be like building in all of the cool individual stuff, but I'm not gonna not do it because that would be stupid. Oh, I nearly did that wrong. That was nearly, that was nearly a bad, a bad moment in my life. Anyways, I just wish Alita Battle Angel did, like, better. Death Death and Robots is good. I love that. I love that show. I love... Okay, my thing... I used to come home from school, and the thing I would do is literally I would sit down, I would go on the internet, and I would look up, like, film, like, uh, student, student films. So, like, animated student films that these people had done from, like, college and stuff. That's what I would look up. I'd be like, wow, this is so cool. I'm going to go look up, like, different films students have done. And I would just sit and watch those. And uh, Love, Death, Robots is literally that, but, like, it's literally that, but, like, professionals. So it's all these really cool... I know some people who absolutely fucking hate short stories because they're open-ended and they want a conclusion to everything, but I'm like, no, no. Sometimes it's cool to like, why don't you want to think about the content you're consuming? I feel like saying every single story has to have a definitive ending that wraps every single thing up is like the laziest shit ever. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Do you not like to think about the media you consume? Sorry. Swag. Uh, oh, I guess this piece is this. I want everything to be neatly tied up with a bow for the for the viewer's consumption. How about you uh, learn how to critically think about anything? Thank you. Honestly, when I was watching Love, Death, and Robots, it was, I was thinking was I could turn each of these into a tabletop game. That's 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 fun. I like that. I just don't like when people are like, oh, it was bad, and I'm like, well, why why was this why was it bad? And they're like, well, cause it it didn't have an ending, and I'm like, it did have an ending. It was when it ended. That was the ending. And they're like, well, it didn't it didn't wrap everything up. And I'm like, yeah, because it wasn't supposed to. Like, that was that was the point. The point was now you as the audience member have to think about what what it was. Like, what is the ending? Like, how do you think it would conclude? And they're like, well, that's lazy writing. It fucking isn't. <laughs> that's lazy writing. You're stupid, and I don't like you. Oh, the blue is like, huh? <laughs> it's, I don't like it. It's lazy writing. Bruh. You know what's lazy? Uh, being so silly that you're like, I refuse to think about the media that I'm watching. <laughs> like, okay, I guess. I guess you don't have to use your brain. You're so silly when you want me to think about what I'm consuming. <laughs> and then there are like short stories that are, there are short films that are literally about that. Another thing you might like is then called Oats Studio Netflix. It's a bunch of concept shorts by Neil Blockkampf, the guy who directed District 9. Never seen District 9, but that does sound kind of cool. Uh, okay, so this goes here and then this goes here. And then we get a little, little one of these and then... Uh, we need more of these pieces. I just don't understand people who, like, oh, uh, I don't want to say consumers are dumb, but, like, that's what it feels like. <laughs> that's what it feels like when people complain about, oh, it was a short film. It wasn't, like, there's a, di and by the way, there's a difference between being like, oh, it sucked because it didn't explain everything to me, and, um, I didn't like it because, oh, I fucking put this piece on wrong. Damn. And I didn't like it because I wanted more of it. But like, or I guess not, I didn't like it. If you're like, I didn't like it because I wanted more of it, it's like, so you did like it. I did something wrong here. Pause. That's supposed to be like that, which is supposed to be like this. Get off. I did it wrong. I figured it out. I figured it out before it became an issue. We're all good. I added it to the wrong area. We're all- we're safe. We're safe now. I've saved us. I've saved your life. And then this goes like this. Sick. I don't want to use the brick separator. I have fingernails that I will accidentally rip out instead. Thank you very much. Uh, so we got this little thing right there, and then we got this little thing right there, and- Go on the piece, and then we got this little thing right here, and then we got this little one, this little one, go right there. And then we got, um, this little point, wait, what, right, the fuck, this little piece goes right there, and that goes right there, and then this goes right here. Oh my god. What did I miss? You missed, uh, nothing. <laughs> you missed three minutes of building, approximately. I'm so sorry, I actually finished while you were gone. I finished the whole build while you were not here. Um, okay, so then we have three of these that go down like this. Bam. Okay, and then we have... This goes here. And then we have... Two of these, and then we have one more, one more three piece, <laughs> and that's that part of that section. Amazing. Okay, cool. Let's continue building. <laughs> next sec, next next part. This.
goes right here and then it gets a little hug from this Lego piece and then you put this little stud right here and then this little stud goes right there and then it gets a hug from this Lego piece and then we put this right here and then we have Oh no, my mamma mia. I got it real good. I got it real good. And then we go that piece and we have two of those. Two of those go down. Then we have another one of these. Then we have this uh, little brick that goes here. And then we have this little thing that goes here. And then we have that goes there there and then we have another little great piece that goes here and then this goes there wow wow stunning and brave and that goes there and then we have two more of these pieces and then we have another one of these pieces and then we have that goes there this little stud goes here and this piece goes right here. Ta-da! Oh my god, no, there's more! Fuck. Fuck a me. Fuck a me. Fuck a me. Okay. Um, so we're building a thing. Okay, so first off, we're gonna we're gonna have these going all the way over here. Let's just, let's just lay down our outer work now. Lay down, there's a piece of hair. Okay. Lay down the outer work. The outer pieces. And then the little last outer piece. Click. Okay. Do you remember those Lego board games they did ages ago? I have two of those. I have one that's like a maze and one that is something else. <coughs> Ugh. I love antibiotics because they save you, but like... That literally everyone when I got my antibiotics prescribed to me yesterday everyone was like these are gonna give you diarrhea like the doctor said that to me the pharmacist said that to me and uh the other pharmacist said to me they're like these are gonna give you diarrhea and I said that's fine I was like yeah cool I'm experienced I don't it's fine and they were all like okay then that's a little odd but go off queen and I went I will actually I actually will pop off queen uh, this goes like that, that goes like that, let's put this little brick right here, snap, and then this little fucker goes here! Oh, I got- no, I got hair stuck in it! Stop. And then this, I love putting- I love snapping the, like, click- oh, satisfying! It's like building an Ikea shelf with my dad. That goes there, and then that goes there, and then the pieces needs to go there. Bye, Tripic. I hope you come back to see more Lego. Okay, I'm gonna have to take this shirt off because... It's getting... Mildly warm. I really hope I didn't just, like, flash my bra. Oh my god! Ah! Scandalous! A bra strap! Call the police. Is that against Twitch 2 us? So I was sniffing to see if my armpits smell bad. They don't yet. We're all good. Twitch police, Twitch police. Put that strap. I keep that. I keep that strap on me. It's my bra strap. That's funny. That's funny. That's funny. That's funny. Comedy right there. Comedy police. Comedy police. Um. So let me do one, two, three, four, five. So we have five of these we need to put on here. Bra. My brother in Christopher Columbus. You're scaring the hoes. Okay. Could you snap, crackle, pop into fucking place? Can I use YouTube studio music in the background of stuff because it's copyright free? I feel like I should be able to. Okay, so then we do uh, one, two, there. One, two, there. One, two, here. Nailed it. And then we need another little grate. Grate piece. 
I'm a great Lego builder. Um, so then there's supposed to be two of these in between each of these. Quick maths. Six divided by three is two. Bam. I'm a fucking genius. I'm a fucking genius, mate. Sometimes people ask me, ma'am, how are you so fucking smart? And I go, I'm a fucking genius. Uh, so that goes there. Oh, did we just have like a line of these till we hit there? Sick. Game Rebel, sup. Sup to you, my dude. We're just building this little Lego set. This isn't complicated right now because this isn't a 3D structure, really. I mean, it technically is, but, like, it isn't. But as soon as we get to the, like, 3D, 3D part, I I fear for my life. Because if I fuck that up, even remotely, it's gonna be, like, a multiple, uh, like, it's gonna be, like, a fuck moment. Like, a, like a fuck moment. So, yeah. Oh my god, is that like a fire hydrant? Is that supposed- oh, fuck you. Is this supposed to be like a little- like a little fire hydrant? So cute. Lego City said, yeah, we don't violate city code. Duh. We have fire hydrants for our Lego fires. Okay, I think I did it. Why do- oh my god, little Lego bitch! <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, it's gonna be me as a Lego person. Oh my god, my favorite, oh, what I've always wanted to be in the service industry. Okay, well, look, ah, she's so cute. I love her. I love her. So these are extra pieces, I think. So let's just put those over there. Moving on to bag number two. Where? Oh. Bag number two. A man, a man has fallen into the river. I feel like you're the type of creative person that would go nuts in the best way with those Lego dot sets. Oh, I have a bunch of those. I wanted to do like one of the murals, but I don't have enough colors. And so my idea, listen, what I was going to fucking do was I was going to get like the Lego dot set and I was going to like paint the individual dots, the colors I needed. And then I went, why the fuck am I doing that when you could literally buy them online and it would take less time? But, uh, then I decided that I didn't need to start getting into that because that's crazy shit. Okay. Ah! Bye! Felicia. Okay. Let's. Ah. Uh, a man has fallen into the river at Lego City. Watch him drown. Oh my god, wait. Do, do they have the trolley problem in Lego? Where it's like... Um... Are you gonna save the Lego characters or let them fucking die? They should have that. Is this a motherfucking croissant? Oh my god. Lego thought of everything. They said, let's give you a hot little, um, bellhop dude. And also a Lego croissant, which probably will be, like, something else. It's probably not gonna be a croissant, but, you know. Where's your hair, my dude? Oh my god. Oh my god, you have really nice hair. Can you give me some hair tips? Oh my god, I wear a ponytail every day. Your hair is so stylish. Yeah, you wanna, wanna come with me to the third floor? Uh, there is no third floor yet, you fucking idiot. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, I killed the bellhop. He fell and died. Anyways. <clears throat> Croissant. The bellhop fell and died. What can I say? That really sucks for him. Okay, we have to build a bellhop car, apparently. Where the fuck is the bellhop car pieces? Are they in here? Okay, it says, I need a two by four. I need a two by four! I found it. Okay, now it says to put this little, wait. Yeah, this little piece on. And this little piece on. And then this little piece. Are you fucked in the head? I dropped it, it's fine. We're all good. 
Ignore the question I just asked myself. We don't have to acknowledge the fact that I just asked myself if I was fucked in the head. Anyways, the stream is going great. We're building this Lego thing. Oh my god, it doesn't fucking fit. What did I do wrong? Oh, those aren't- I don't need those pieces yet. That's what I did wrong. <gasps> oh my god, so you put the little- Oh my god, you put the little poles in the thing, and then- Oh my god, they're like little spaghetti noodles! Cute. Imagine I just played Barbie with two Lego people and dropped one of them into the void. Yeah, it fucking died. Sorry. Oh, shit. Wait. Okay. Where's the other little noodle? Oh, I'm sorry. Do you not play Lego Barbie with your fucking Lego people? Sounds like a you problem. Sounds like a you problem. Sounds like you don't have fun with Lego. Like I have fun with Lego. Lego murder on stream. Bye, Sparg! Ah. I'm a Lego bellhop person. Oh, I forgot to. Sorry, I forgot to. Oh, I have to rotate these. So that the bellhop can have these little poles on it. Oh my god. I forgot to do a step. Yeah, I forgot to add the wheels. My bad. Let me just... Oh, I dropped him. Oh, oh. Ow, that hurt my finger. I poked myself with the Lego. Oh my gosh, little wheels. Ha <laughs> ah. <gasps> No way this rolls. Oh my god. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god, guys. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Okay, the next step is get out of your mind. We're gonna do go in the corner. Fuck. We're gonna do three little things like this. Do, do, do. Three little things. Then we go a space over and we go three more. You fucking better click on there. Uh. And we go doot doot doot. And then we click over like this. Boop. Boop. And we need a weird- Ooh, these are cool. They're little angly dudes. That's neat. Lego is so cool. Because it's like, how the fuck did they start with like these basic bricks and then somehow like- managed to make them so mathematically interesting that you could make all these other bricks fit the fucking the math the brains the intelligence <sighs> cannot cannot compare i have to blow my nose again give me a minute <clears throat> i just popped my ears that's weird okay cool the Lego ingenuity. The lignanuity. I invented a new word just now. That was me. If it goes in the dictionary, I expect uh, patent rights. Not patent rights. Trademark rights. Thank you. Uh, I don't need these two pieces yet, but I do need a bunch of these. Ligna. <laughs> That's like ligma, but stupid. <laughs> Okay, so this goes right there, and then this goes right here, and then this? Where are you, you dot bitch? Where? Where's the one with the dot on it? Oh my gosh, I've, I don't have one? Where? Where are you? Where's the one with the dot on it? Is there only one in this entire thing? I need one with a dot! Oh, it's in the other. Cool. Cool of you, Lego. <clears throat> Confuse my little brain by putting it in the other section. <coughs> oh, I need one more with a dot. Luckily, I know where it is now. Because Lego cannot fool me twice. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, not gonna fucking happen. Because I'm so good at Lego. 
You can never fool me twice. A click and a click. Next fucking step, bitch! Okay, now we have to add... This goes right here, okay? And then this goes right there. And then this goes like that. And then where's the red piece? And then this little red piece goes right in here, like that. I'm a genius. I have genius. I'm genius. Thank you. Uh, this little piece goes right there. And then this little piece goes right here. And then this little piece goes up your butt. And then this little piece goes boop, boop. I'm so good at this. I'm a Lego professional. Next step. Oh my god, they've re they've they've rotated this shit. They rotated it. Oh fuck. Okay, so this goes here and this goes here. And then we put this in the corner and this in the corner. I don't like that they've rotated it. I felt so I felt safe. I felt safe. And now they've changed everything up on me. They've changed everything up again, and now I'm not safe anymore. Oh, I fucking did this wrong. Oh, fuck me. Ugh. How do I use this piece? Is it like that? No, is it like this? <gasps> oh my god, that's so cool. That's so cool that the specialty tool designed for Lego actually works. I fucked it up a little bit, but it's okay, because I've unfucked it now. That's right, I'm a genius. I'm a little genius. I unfucked it. Can I use this as like a- Oh my gosh, you can even use it as a little pokey tool to fucking tell it to get in place. Genius. Genius, I tell you. This is a very satisfying stream. Hell yeah, thank you. Um... <sighs> okay, where does this piece go? This piece goes right here. Okay, and then we have this piece that goes right here. And then we have all these little fuckers that go everywhere because fuck. Am I right, ladies and gentlemen? This tile floor is so fancy. Oh my god, this must be a luxury resort. This must be the luxury the luxurious resort. Oh my god. Darling, did you get us tickets to the Lego resort? I only want to go to the Lego boutique hotel. Anywhere else is simply not good enough, Jonathan. I want a divorce. Can Lego characters get divorces? Do Legos have rights? You have rights. All of the little things are like... Uh, this. Nailed it. I'm asking the real questions. This is making me want to open the Star Destroyer. Dude, you should do it. And remember, you don't have to build the whole Lego set at once. As long as you have a container that you can put the pieces in that you haven't used, just finish whatever step you did, and then you're probably good. I think I just fucked this up. What is this? Oh, duh. There's supposed to be a piece there I didn't I didn't add yet. My bad. My mistake. pretty this little this little design is so cute oh my god look at this little design and then we get these like little oh my god then these go in the little corners like that doot, doot. 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 and then we put the other little pieces in the middle Give me them. Thank you. They go like this. Oh wait, no, they go like. 
How the fuck do these? Oh my god. Ah, uh, oh, they go like this. They're like little pieces of pizza. Okay, that makes more sense. I could not figure it out for a second. Satisfying as fuck. Okay, um, and that's that step. Oh my god, the next step is finish everything. <laughs> wow, who would have guessed? Okay, so this goes here. And then... I cannot tell. That must be this. It has to be. Okay, cool. No way I'm getting that close to it. Yeah, this is 3,000 pieces and I don't- I don't know. I don't think we're gonna finish this all in one stream. I think I would die, so... I cannot imagine trying to do a 8,000 piece Lego set in one sitting. I think you would also die, so... No comment. Um, okay, so now... That goes three down. Okay, it goes one over. Do do. Okay, so right here? This goes right there? Eh. Oh no. No, I'm fine. Okay. <sighs> Had a moment. Had a moment where I was like, I've done this wrong. I did not do it wrong. I just got a little bit confused. Okay. So we have these pieces which need to go there and there. And then this piece has to go there. And then. This piece goes here. Okay. And then this piece goes right there and then this piece goes right there and then this piece goes right there amazing i'm a i'm talented i did it now we have this piece goes there and this piece goes there and one more and then we have this thing goes like that and then this thing goes like this and then this goes right here and then we have this little one brick that goes here, one brick goes here. Is this it? This goes here? Yeah! And then this goes here, like a that. And then we have another one of these. And then one more of these the floor is like almost done can we oh my god what is it pointing at oh oh i need two little things okay we have this one which goes right oh they've rotated again fuck we have this that goes here and this goes here and then we have is that a three? Is that a three? Okay, that's a three. And then we have these, which go like this. Dude. Dude. And this goes, like, right in this corner. Bam. That's all. That's that. Okay. Oh, fuck. Am I building a- <gasps> That's a little dumpster. Oh, my God. That's so cute. We're building a little dumpster. That's adorable. Are you meant to be putting black studs in all the bits with sticking out connectors in the middle? No, okay, those that's just their that's just the way they illustrate it, but um they're not they're not black studs sticking out. They're they're just like to show that they have the little thing on the little the little nub on top. Oh my god, we're making a little dumpster! Oh it's so cute! Where does this go? A little dumpster. I think this is a this better be a dumpster, because like it really looked like one. I don't- this must be a dumpster. Like, I don't know what else this could be. Uh, so I've done that. Uh. Bye, Plague Lord! Okay, wait. Okay, well here's some more- let's just take all these little blue pieces out, because I'm assuming they're all- for the dumpster that I'm building. Okay, so I did this. I did that. Okay, I'm supposed to add this here, and then this piece here, and then 
Oh my god, it's a little dumpster. Like... This shit is so cute. What the fuck? It's literally a little dumpster. Like... Lego has outdone themselves with this little dumpster. This is the best Lego build ever. Oh my god, and you put the little croissant, croissant in the dumpster because it's gone bad. Adorable. Adorable. 10 out of 10 dumpster build. 10 out of 10 would build again. Okay, so then you put these two little pieces on here. And... Uh, this piece? So this goes, oh, I fucking, oops, oh, whatever. This goes like that. And then, what the fuck? I'm missing something. Ah, oh, this is what I'm missing. And then this goes like this. Oh, and then this goes like this. And then... I did something wrong. I did something wrong. Okay, wait. Undo it. Undo it. Undo it. Come on, me lose my sense of taste now. I feel like I'm playing League of Legends. Oh my god. <laughs> that's a, that's that's kind of funny. Okay. So I put this on this. Okay. Step 2. This like this. Step three. Oh, okay. I did it wrong. Easy enough. I fixed it. We're all good. Oi. And now we do that. And then we put it on this little thing. Oh my God. Look at this motherfucking dumpster. My day is going pretty good. I just made it up. Oh my God. And the dumpster goes in like the little back alley. Oh my God. It's a little dumpster. That is so cute. Okay. Oh my god. We're building up the walls a little bit. We're building up the walls a little bit. Okay, that's a sixer, which is this. And this starts right he right here. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're building up the walls. We're building up. Oh my god. We're building up a little bit. We're building up a little bit. It's starting. It's starting. The white pieces are over one line mad wait what wait what No, they aren't. They're not. You fucking, you're lying to me. They're not. They're not. They are absolutely not. I will not be lied to. We forgot some brown pieces bottom right. Oh, thank God. Thank you. <laughs> I definitely did. Boop. And then that's empty. This has one of these in it. Okay, cool. And then that's a four. This is a four with a one. Like so. A little one goes here, and then we have uh, six. Six, 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 six. And then we have another fucking six. And then we have two fours. And a one. Where's the one? 
Oh no. Wait. No, we don't have a one. This just goes here. Okay, we're good. We're all good. We're all good. Whew! Okay. Um. So we start with this. Then we put one of these on it. And then we put this here. And then we put this here and then that goes like that okay that goes like no that goes like this that goes like that and then this goes like this okay cool 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 now we gotta do this snap And then this goes like that. And then this little piece goes like right like that. And then this little piece goes here. And then this little piece goes here. No, don't you dare fall and get lost. And then this goes here. And then this goes here. Oh my god, there's more pieces. And then this and that. Okay, so these hug and th nope, that's the wrong piece. These hug and these go right here. And then these go right here. And then Oh, God. Okay. Then these go like this and this. And. Oh, these are like staircases, I think. Right? This must be the staircase, right? Like, I'm not crazy. This is a staircase, right? And then those go there. And this fucking. Where did. I think it's pointing to the middle part. I don't know. Okay, cool. So now we have a sixer. A six. And a little two. Like so. And then this long dude. And then this dude goes like that. And then this dude goes like this and then this dude goes like this and then this dude goes like that okay and then this dude goes like wait i did something wrong oh no okay then we have a this goes like this and this goes like this and then this gets that and that and that and then uh this goes over here and this goes over here and then this goes over here and then this goes like this and like that and then this goes like this is this like a door okay it looks like it's a door that lines up with this okay oh my god how the fuck do these lego ass geniuses build this shit like how the fuck does that work oh my god they're so smart they're just like yeah we bend physics fuck you we're geniuses Blah. 
And I have my two little dudes, and they're just gonna be- they're just gonna sit down in the corner. And here's the bellhop thing. Okay. I love Lego. Lego's so cool. I'm gonna turn off the chroma key now on this. So I don't forget, and then later go, why is that weird? Why is that weird? Okay, where is my... Filters! Chroma key. Off. Okay. So we're on page... 34. Let me quickly go over to page 34. Out of, how many pages are in this fucking book? 263. Um, when you went blonde. What do you mean, when did I go blonde? I've, I've had this hair color for months, to be honest. Forever, probably. I've had this hair color since I was born. Just kidding. Amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Nailed it. We did it, guys. We built part of a Lego set. Hi, by the way. Hello. This is forbidden, like, that is forbidden Lego, like, that is forbidden Lego technique. The fact that there is a little ass dumps, like, that's so cute. That, that just makes me sad, because it's like, I'm not gonna display it with this as the front, so no one's gonna say, I'm gonna have to move the dumpster to the front of the hotel. I'm gonna have to move the dumpster to the front of the hotel. That's so tragic. Don't forget to stretch. Oh, fuck. I gotta. One second, guys. Oh! Did you hear that? Bitch, why the fuck did you give me money? Bitch, why Don't the forget fuck to stretch. I'm gonna look at how this time lapse looks and see if it looks cool. Okay? Cool. Thank you for the bits. Oh my god, this time lapse is cool. I love time lapses. Man, time lapses are like my favorite. I love watching them so much. I put this phone back in this case so that it doesn't get broken more phone in a case phone case oh my god is that why they're called phone cases as the hiccups <laughs> how could this happen to me why <laughs> <laughs> i haven't had the hiccups in so long <laughs> what the fuck what the fuck is this where did these come from Where did they go? Where did they come from? Cotton Eye Joe. Welcome beyond the new. Anderson Ward Grubb is the person who designed this. I'm gonna look that man up. Anderson Ward Grubb. Anderson Grubb, senior product designer at the Lego Group. I am passionate about design and entertainment. Oh my god, this man worked at, like, Legoland for 12 years.
That's cool. He was a field representative for the U.S. House of Representatives in 2006. The depart- In the Department of Defense and Department of Veteran Affairs? How the fuck did this man go from that to building Lego? Yeah, sorry, I worked in the defense sector actually for a while, and then I decided, mm, I'm gonna transition to Lego. What? I mean, king. King shit. That was a king move. Only a king would be like, oh, yeah, I used to work for the fucking government, and now I work for Lego. That's right, I worked in Legoland after I worked for the Secretary of Defense. What the fuck? What the fuck do you mean? Anyways, that's pretty interesting of him to do that. I'm gonna die now. See you tomorrow at 1.30.